your hello great people african traveler again so hope you guys are good and yeah today guys we're going to take you to different part of nairobi so if you're living around nairobi or if you're passing by nairobi you probably passed a road under construction somewhere you know either major road or minor road or major construction so it got to a point uh, i thought like is nairobi closed for construction because like every part of nairobi are trying to leave this road under construction either minor road or major road and uh, yeah due to that today i decided let me just capture some of the major uh, construction updates that are going on in the city so that you guys can you know get to see what is happening within Nairobi and yeah this is not only Nairobi in other major towns like uh, Mombasa, Kisumu, even smaller towns there's a lot of construction going on in the country and uh, it's a good thing so come with me and don't forget to subscribe like and share as I show you guys around uh, the major construction updates going on in Nairobi right now. So this, the first project to review is the Western Bypass Road project. So this road is one of the four bypasses built to direct motorized traffic away from the central business district of Nairobi and uh, to alleviate the perennial traffic jam on the city streets. Uh, the, the, the bypass highway include Nairobi Northern Bypass, and Nairobi Eastern Bypass, as well as the Southern Bypass. So the Western Bypass uh, links the Southern Bypass and the Northern Bypass. It links Western Bypass at Gitaru, uh, Southern Bypass at Gitaru, and the Northern Bypass at Ruaka. The total uh, ring road uh, created by all these four bypasses makes a, a ring road of about a 96.7 kilometer uh, stretch or 60 miles. So the Western Bypass development, it also involves a construction of 17.7 kilometer uh, of service roads uh, within the area, as well as a total of six interchanges and overpasses that will be built one each one in each six township where the four lane dual carriage is planned to pass so yeah so guys if i'm not wrong from the initial plan i noticed some changes at uh, Denderu. i thought there was supposed to be a, an amazing interchange so right now it's just a roundabout i don't know if uh, there was something that changed or if that was the initial plan as well as the Ruaka, the interchange where it meets uh, the northern bypass i still don't see a lot of change so i don't know if uh, there was a change of plan so you guys just leave a comment on the comment section below so this yeah this road is really opening up the area and uh, it's one of the best road right now to use just to avoid the perennial Nairobi traffic jam yeah that's our first uh, major road to show you guys let's go to the next one project is the construction of the T-Mall flyover along Langata Road. This is a three billion road project that is supposed to really ease the traffic around this place of Langata because uh, there's something like a cross here and it's usually very hectic. So the project is supposed to go through different uh, phases and about seven different phases at different time and about take about 36 uh, months. So far I think there's a lot of change that we can see and uh, I don't know what the different phases entails but uh, I can't wait to see. But this is one of the major projects in Nairobi that will really really help the city in a major way. The Timor uh, flyover, some people call it a viaduct and it's a cooperation between uh, the government of Kenya and uh, the Spanish government. Next major project is the James Gishuru Rironi Road that 
most part of it is in Kiambu County. This is a project that could cost about $163 million and started about 2017. So yeah, this is one of those roads that uh, have been derailed, but right now there's a lot of progress ongoing and it's one of the uh, few roads that are made out of concrete. In short, they're concrete road. And this road carries a lot, 85% of the freight carriage you know so this road actually is concrete because of the uh, most of the trucks uh, with that uses the road uh trucks heading all the way to uganda all the way to tanzania all the way to different parts of east africa so it's one of the major highways uh, that you know trucks use so hence uh, why they use uh, concrete on a bitter part of it especially from kikuyu going all the way to rironi <laughs> The other major road that will help in easing traffic within Nairobi is the Machakos Town of Road Project. So there's a road that starts from all the way from Mati River to Machakos Town of that is currently under construction. One of those roads that have been there for long, that have been under construction for long. I don't know why it took that time. So the project is a section of the A8 National Highway in Kenya. Generally, the project is construction of the second carriageway of Mati River, Machakos Town of section of Nairobi Mombasa Road. It's situated in Machakos in the eastern province of Kenya and uh, this is a section that right now has so many industries guys. I took you back sometimes back on this road. There are so many industries across this stretch and uh, this crazy crazy traffic and uh, the road starts exactly where the expressway ends and uh, proceeds all the way to Machakos. So this is also the main highway that leads all the way to Mombasa. So a lot of change is coming along this stretch and uh, the expansion came at the right time. This is the other road project that is really helping to ease traffic within the city of Nairobi. Some of the road projects are not in Nairobi, but they are in within the Nairobi metropolitan area. So last but not least, we have the Eastern Bypass expansion. So this road was among the first bypasses to be constructed. And right now it's just a nightmare. It's a super crazy nightmare. It's tra there's traffic from Monday to Monday. And uh, this is due to the crazy number of population that came to this area after the bypass was constructed. So right now it's a great savior that this road is currently under construction. So I can't really, you know, this was a bypass, but Right now, people are running away from it. You know, it's uh, stretched all the way to Kamaki's, all the way from Pipeline. And uh, I can tell you for sure, it's easier for you to use outer ring and go to Thika rather than use this road right now, unless you're going to Utawala. <music> Thank you.
Maka right now. Progress. So this is the Western Bypass, a 17 kilometer road. So guys, we are right now at Wangige. Now, this is where you'll find the biggest egg market in East Africa. This is one of the places that had crazy traffic because it was it has one of some of the biggest market in, uh, in Kiambu. So we at Gitaru. This is the Gitaru Bridge. Right now it's a nightmare to cross here. So guys, we're on Langata Road. Yeah, seems seems to be an interchange that is under construction. No, a, a footbridge. Guys, there's a viaduct here. It's coming up very nicely. This is Langata. Yet, oh, this is uh, Kenyatta Avenue. Around community, there's an expansion going on. I'll brief you guys later. So guys, probably I forgot a project. So if I, in case I forgot a project, don't forget to share it on the description box below. Uh, on the comment section below, I will probably tag it on the next video. Or probably want to feature it. Or if there's a specific project you'd want us to feature, please don't forget to mention. So yeah, we'll be more than glad. I'm sure there's Mau. Uh, guys have been asking us for Mau Mau Road. And uh, one of the biggest things, this is about 500 kilometer road stretch. And I don't know where to specifically start uh, featuring the road from. I'm really confused. I check it on the map. I'm really confused. So if you know exactly the best place to start uh, checking on the road because it traverses over three counties. So I would want to, almost five counties. I would want to know where exactly we can start. Where is, where is, there is a big change uh, in a town where we can start to feature the road. So if you know the place, just drop a comment on the section below and we'll be more than glad to show you guys the project. So yeah, see you guys on the next one. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Thank you.